All right, so let's say I found a video on YouTube. This one is playing and staying safe online, and I want to show it to my class. Uh, I'm going to go over a couple different ways uh, in this video is how you can show that without having the videos over on the right-hand side appear. Because sometimes, even though this is a video from Google and it's about staying safe online, there may be videos, and these are pretty tame, but there may be <clears throat> other ones on the right-hand side that you don't want to necessarily have up on the smart board or on the projector in front of your room. So here's one way to do it. I know this video is called playing and staying safe online. So when I'm you know, browsing around getting my lesson ready for the day, I could use a Google presentation, which is just under your staff start page and which is in staff zone or school zone, and uh, click right on the main button to give you your docs. And this is, uh, this is one of the options. So I've just made, and this is the default presentation. I put a title on it um, and I'm just gonna go to insert video and right away it's gonna search in YouTube and I'm going to put in staying safe online and search and playing. There it is right there. Playing and staying safe online. Now I can also browse through a few other ones here and see what else is up and preview them um, right in the little window here. Okay. With JYs. No, I'm not going to use that one. Um, I'm familiar with this first one, so I just click on it. Yep, that's the one I want. It's giving me a little preview here. Sounds good. And select. And it drops it right into my slide right away with no surrounding videos or anything like uh, anything like that it's very clean and down here I can add any text you know um, about the video so okay answer question one and again just to show you quickly how that was I'm going to insert another one so I'm going to insert another uh, let's go title only slide this one's going to be called um, another safety video Okay, insert, video, and I still have these, the same search is still saved in there, and I know there's another one down here from Google, this one. Little preview, I know that's the one I want. Select, it drops it in there. Now the nice thing is, when I am done, that's again, it's saving automatically, just like any Google presentation. Click here, we'll call this uh, internet safety. Great. Now when I'm in class and I want to play this for my students, I just click on Start Presentation. You're only seeing a snippet of it. Let me just reduce the size of that a little bit. There's what it looks like when you play it, right? And I'll go to the next slide. And again, if you double click on the little video icon, it actually launches for you and plays online. The nice thing about these is, as well is that um, now that you're done, you take that presentation, you click share, you share it with your class, your students, or, or with a group by name, and it's available to them at home or anywhere else as well. We can share it with, post it on SchoolZone for the parents to see or anything. All right, that's the first way.